Hello everyone, my name is Marco or SparksSLX and in this video I'm going to show you how to record a Skype caller in Logic Pro X using Loopback 2. Loopback is a great piece of software, I've been using it for a while to help with recording my own podcast. It's allowed me to route audio from Skype and other sources into Logic Pro for recording. So let's, uh, let's jump right into it. So when you first open Loopback, this is what you're going to see. In the left hand side panel, over here, you're going to find where all of your virtual devices will exist. And on the right side, this is where you'll configure all of those devices. So let's go ahead and start by clicking on a uh, new virtual device. This will start your first device, as which is a pass-through device. We're going to change that quickly. Uh, I'm going to change the name of Loopback to DAW, which is Digital Audio Workstation. Uh, and I'm going to select pass through and we're going to click command delete to delete that. Now we're going to come up here to sources and I'm going to add Skype. I'm going to add my own microphone, which is a Zoom H6. Uh, and I'm going to add Farago, which is a piece of software that allows you to play snippets of audio. It's basically a soundboard. Once you've added all your devices, you'll want to come in and you'll want to delete um, all of these little lines and you could just select them and use command delete to actually get rid of them and now we're going to actually root our audio so loopback makes it really easy and intuitive to loop audio to certain channels and ultimately all you have to do is click on these little circles and drag out a um, a little line to whichever channel you want. So I'm going to drag this out to channel one. You'll see that my audio is coming through channel one. I'm going to take the Skype audio from left and right and I'm going to channel them into channel two. And then I'm going to create an output and I'm going to use Farago in channel three. Uh, so now uh, just to do a little bit of a test, I'm going to make sure that mute when capturing is not on for both of these um, and then we're going to go we're going to open up Farago we're going to test the audio I'm just going to play a piece of snippet this is the intro to my podcast and as you can see when I play the audio it goes to channel 3 so now that we have set this up we are going to open Logic Pro uh, Logic Pro probably has already detected a new device says, do you want to use loopback audio device? Um, I'm going to say don't use, or actually we can say use. Uh, we can say use twice. We are going to start a new project. And uh, now you'll see that DAW is the device in which Logic Pro will be using for the inputs. So we can select input one, okay? And we can add our first track. This track, as you can see, based on this little meter here is my microphone. So I'm just gonna label it microphone. And then we're gonna add another track. We can come add track two. We're gonna create, we're gonna call this one Skype. Okay. And then we're gonna add track three, which is going to be Farago. And I'm just gonna call this one FX. So now just to test this all, uh, what we're going to want to do is you're going to want to arm every single track that you have, okay? And you're going to want to start a recording. Uh, so in this case, we've started the recording. You can see as I talk, the waveform creates. Um, if we throw up Farago again and we start the podcast, you can see that is also recording. And then finally, last but not least, we're going to bring up uh, Skype, I'm going to do a test call, make a free test call here. Hello, welcome to Skype call testing service. After the beep, please record a message. Afterwards, your message will be played back to you. So as you can see, this is the Skype recording. So I'm going to now, that that's pretty much how you set it up. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to play your mic and any other audio source to your Skype caller. Hopefully this video has been helpful. If it has, please feel free to leave a like. If you dislike this video, double tap that dislike button, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.